Is this your father? Yes. He looks nice. Can we continue? Do your clients ask about your personal life a lot? It's not unheard of. I guess people just try to avoid whatever it is they came to talk about. Well, uh, usually when people... So who's the craziest person you've ever worked with? Oh, God. It's not me, is it? <sighs> we try to see them as people in different stages of recovery. I'd like to talk to you about your father. I don't want to talk about that today. Does he know you're here? No. He wouldn't like that. He's... traditional. I spent most of my childhood with my mother back in California. But he still can't accept that part of me. I'm not a typical Korean girl. Or daughter. What do you consider yourself, culturally? Sometimes I dream in Korean. Sometimes I think in English. Usually, it just gets mixed up. Mixed up how? I feel like I can't express myself. You're expressing yourself now? You only know this part of me. I'd like to get to know the other side, too. But this will only work if you meet me halfway. I want to move on. I don't know who else to talk to. Have you tried talking to your father? No. He pretends like it never happened. Like he's already moved on. I know you were uncomfortable about this when I asked you before. No. You want to move on. This is part of the process. What are you writing? It's a pretty book. My mother gave it to me. Can we talk about your mother? You mean... her suicide? Losing a parent is never easy. And when it happens in that way, you can begin to question your own existence. <laughs> 